Connor, uh, you signed for Colts United. How whirlwind has the last few days been for you? A lot of travelling. Um, just obviously buzzing to get here now and just can't really wait to get started. And, and how did you hear about the interest from Colts United being in Scotland? Obviously, I hadn't played the last couple of games in Scotland and um, I was playing out of position. So I think it was upon myself to kind of ask a question to the manager if I was ever going to be back in the team and obviously if I was going to get back in my position and play. I wasn't, so I kind of needed to look elsewhere. I, I haven't had the best two years playing games. Obviously, I've been injured for a while and I um, felt like this was probably the right step for me to take to go and get games and obviously get my career back on track. And obviously the link with Colchester is going to be Ross Hamilton, who, who uh, played under at Orient. Yeah, he was my manager at Orient. We had a really good season under him and we worked really well together, so hopefully we can uh, get that off to start on Saturday. Yeah, and obviously a bit of uh, uncertainty at the moment with uh, the head coach going at, at, on, on New Year's Day, but you must feel that it's a club that you can come into and make an impact and enjoy your time down here. That's the aim, yeah. Like I say, it doesn't really matter who's the manager to me. It's, I want to get in the team and try and score some goals and help the team lift on the table as, as soon as we can. Obviously, no one wants to be near the bottom. It's going to be a challenge, but it's a challenge I'm ready for and I just I can't wait to get started. And obviously, uh, you know, you're know you going to meet all the lads uh, in your first day of training tomorrow. Yeah. Do you know any of them or will it be walking into a, a change room there you don't know anyone? Just, uh, just know Cam McGee and it's the only person I know so far. So, like I say, hopefully I'll make some friends early on and uh, it's easy as. Yeah, and I mean, all the lads that we've spoken to this season say it's a close-knit group, a tight group. But, you know, they'll, they'll all want wins to build confidence and, and get us back up the table. Uh, I presume that's exactly the same as what you want. Of course, like you say, if you've got a good group, then obviously you've got a good foundation to, to do well in the league. And like you say, if you've got a good group of boys, all it takes together is to get a couple of wins and before you know it, you're looking up the table rather than down.